What's up everybody? We are back with another YouTube video. Today we're going to Alpha Land, home of the Alphas. Yeah. Here with the most Alpha, Dawson. Formerly known as P Trent. Formerly. <laughs> formerly. And TNF. He's just the most controversial natty alive. What we are doing currently is we are doing these at-home testing kits right now because we are going to compare, Joel is going to compare TNF. All of our different blood <laughs> All of our different blood levels. Dawson, enhanced. I am enhanced. Yeah. TNF and hands. And so we're going to be doing these, but they're you a little more. Let me see. Let me see what you yeah. Have. We've been we've been working. Obviously, it's almost like if you was on her. So, you know, <laughs> that time of the month, you know. Why does it look kind of familiar? Yeah, exactly. I've been there before. <laughs> we all have. <laughs> Just like, well. So we are filling up these little vials. What all are we doing, Joel? Uh, I'll, let you, I'll let you focus on milking Dawson. Jeez, this guy has <laughs> no blood in him. Maybe he needs some more water or something. Have you been able to get yours? Yes. Yeah, as as I'm like, almost done. Oh, almost, yeah. I got a little more left. So pretty much how you do these is three different boxes. One of them's like cortisol, and then the other two you have to fill with blood, right? But what you do is they send you these. It's almost like a blood glucose monitor in the morning, where it has like the, it's the spring-loaded little pin. So you twist it off, and it's this little guy, right? I feel bad. Take this guy. We're gonna go for our shit. Where did these two? <laughs> Third finger, three big, three Damn, large. Okay. Three large. You're getting Pretty freaky much. deaky. Exactly. Yeah, you just take it. It's spring loaded, just like a little needle in there. Just take it, shove it in, and then it just. Oh, that's easy as hell. Yeah, and it starts. Oh, that wasn't a good one though. So how long does it like usually take, like to actual measure it? Well, as long as it takes to fill these little vials. This is the first one, but it's the biggest one. We're almost done with this bad boy. And pretty much you just take this. That was a horrible pen. Right See that? That is not a good one, guys. Amateur, bro. Amateur. Well, this is my first time doing this. So. What a fucking noob. Freaking niche. <laughs> that's the one you want. See? Yeah. That's the one you want. And then you kind of you kind of just milk your finger. Bro, with no context, just like looking at this it's clip. So you just gotta milk your finger. You just gotta milk that's it. That's what you want. I think that's it. Yeah, this one's flowing. All right. It's that time of month. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna beat Marcus. <laughs> <laughs> He's been bleeding more than me. Dude, I've been. I feel like I've been bleeding a lot more than Dawson. It's just about the angle. So that's what. That's what it's about the angle, bro. Motion. I feel like you should just let me do it for you the way I did it for Dawson. Oh, I've never done a cortisol test. Really? It should be. It's either gonna be really high or really low. So it should. Could be high. See, I. But with, it could be low. I've tested all the way through. I've tested all the way through a prep and out of a prep. I've never had a high cortisol test. But I'm ever. also on steroids, so it's like does that, that make it lower? You can make it lower. Steroids lower cortisol. Didn't know that. Do they? Yeah. I, I honestly have no clue. Right? Huh. I really didn't know that. On the muscles, you wouldn't have high cortisol because then you'd probably gain fat. You know, lose muscle easier. That's one. That's chronic contestable. Chronically high cortisol. Contestable. Chronic. chronic. <laughs> Here we go Cause again. Cause some, enough shenanigans. Some people's response to cortisol <laughs> is, quite, is quite different. Always got a fact check. Huh? <laughs> your papers, right? Like not want. not papers. Those little cards. Mm -hmm. You have your papers, right? Austin <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Vice. 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 Austin Vice. Austin Vice. Do you have your papers? <laughs> so I was like, <laughs> the, the 1944 came out of me right there. But I'm getting my hands are getting hot hard. We're halfway there, boys. On the last vial. Come on, lad. <laughs> you gonna lock in? Do you want? Do you want me to do it? <laughs> Time to lock in. I'll, I'll do it, and it'll get done immediately. Let him fucking I, do I it. I do want to be able to say that. TNF did milk me at one point in my life. <laughs> my schedule is completely open other than legs, so. Mine's pretty open other than legs, too. I have more fun on a push day, but if you guys did want to do pull, you can always go. Everyone needs a bigger back, so. Garrett? It's kind of one of the things. I mean, Dawson and I both need bigger right, chests. I, want to do, so. I do, too. I need a bigger everything. That's the problem. My girlfriend tells me. Talk, yeah, talk I don't have one. <laughs> Proportions-wise here. Yeah. Personally, I feel like your chest is a pretty strong point. Do you think so? Compared to the rest of your physique? I feel like my shoulders and my arms are my strong point. What are your arms? Probably. Nine, pretty, 19, pretty, 19 and a half? Yeah, 19 and a half. They're pretty close to 20. I've been training recently. Okay. Nah, your chest is probably a strong point. 
Yeah, yeah really? I, that's, that's what I'm looking I, at it right now, and I'm looking at mine. Yeah. Oh, strong point. I think guys who have big chests just get this like idea in their head that the only big chest is Arnold's. Well, I mean, so they're so they're, so they're like yeah. so they just assume like okay, my chest isn't big enough. But it's not. It's not. What I'm curious to see is I don't think I've worked out with somebody who's stronger than me in a very long time. Who's stronger than you? Well, it's like I don't know. Time. It's been a long time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm definitely stronger than you. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. So. All right, squeeze the blood down. TNF has been summoned. Oof. Your hands are cold. Okay. So what I'm gonna have you do <laughs> is you're gonna you're gonna windmill your arm for a little bit and get the blood into your hand. See, he didn't tell us these tricks earlier. Yeah, what we the were hell, doing. Joel? I didn't realize you had an ice box for a hand. <laughs> well, I've been squeezing it for nonstop out of here. Okay. So there you go, guys. Do not take this as indicative of what is normal for these tests because this guy has no circulation. I wonder, Dawson, what do you think? So like my hands are pretty numb all the time because of the GH I'm taking. Yeah. Do you think that could like, I mean, help with like rupture, like disrupt the circulation to the point of this? I don't think so. Cause he's saying like we don't- As long as you're not doing like cocaine or anything, I think you're good. <laughs> I'm not doing cocaine. He didn't know, I got joined Echo last year. Cause I didn't really do any YouTube videos since then, honestly. So I joined Echo last year, we left Rise, and now like Echo's just been like legitimately taken over. Like you guys have probably seen all over the TikTok shop, like oh, yeah. the beater ads. Hell yeah. Non -stop <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> we love those ads. Bro. Everyone just knows us for the beaters and the creatine, but. Um, no, we're, this is my first time at the HQ, and I was just telling him, like, it's cool. It's, it's one thing to see it through, like, the Echo Vision, like, pages and all the athletes and everything, but it's another thing to, like, be here, yeah, like, be a part of it and everything. Because, I mean, even when I joined them, they were, like, a third of this size. Well, now, not even. Like, last year, when he joined, we were at the first warehouse. Yeah, so it was as dude, big as this office. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was yeah, like yeah. a sweatshop. It was, it was, like, a, it was like a tin over. roof on it, and it was like in the middle of Houston. It was boiling hot. We were jumping over like boxes to get to your orders. That's crazy. And it was like we had three single racks, and like now it's like. Yeah, now we're here. It's like, been they, interesting. Yeah. Interesting. yeah. But, Buy Echo. Yeah, Buy Echo. Yeah, code markets if you go to the website. Otherwise, just click TikTok shop. Yeah. He's making pre. I'm off the pre right now. I've just been doing energy drinks. So I'm going to try this one for the first time here in a little bit. New Echo Vision, code markets, or just TikTok shop. I think that's what pr we promote now. It, but when I came, it was like I can't even show you. Not this big. Every time I I come back to Houston, Echo Vision is like I swear double the size of what it was when I came the previous time. Your growth, growth. Oh, by the way, look, it is my liver health because I need these, especially when you're on prep. Didn't you need to take one today? I do need to take them today. There you go. Also, I haven't done this yet, but we will do this eventually, Your shortly. The Echo Vision. Energy. I think you guys actually like it. What? I actually like it. Do they not know that we're filming? See, people thought I was Chris Bumstead. Probably at least here. Without, 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 without. I can see it without the beard for sure. People literally have walked up to me a dozen, like more than a dozen times. Are you Chris Bumstead? <laughs> Even today, I was not getting my fit feel, and some guys like, you know what? I just want to say, you really look like, and I said, I look like Chris Bumstead. So you do, yeah. Though. Oh no, I'm a uh, D-Tran. Like, yeah. fuck that. What the fuck is that? We're doing a chest day. Certified chest only day today. Don't, don't be and, afraid uh, to get close and personal with them. We are doing a just smith like. incline press first. Right? Feeling good. We'll, we'll see. We'll see how this goes. I want one of you to go first because I want to judge what the workout's going to look like. Yeah. I am scared. He's always saying, he's like, I don't know. I've never worked out with someone who's stronger than me. I've never uh, worked out with someone stronger than me. So I'm like, you're the coach. I don't, what kind of weight are you guys going to be using? I mean, for a, for a working set. For a three, three and a quarter, four, I don't know. Depends on feeling. Four? Maybe, depends on how we're feeling. My gosh. He doesn't touch his chest, doesn't count. Zero reps. Zero reps done. <laughs> I want to see what you do before we before I go into it. <laughs> that was your working set? No. Oh, it's a, that was a warm up. Yeah. Oh, okay. Is this a warm up? Depends if you want it to be. You do. All right. Now real sets. Now we're doing the real sets. 
Ah! Come on, up, push. Yep, that ain't going. <laughs> Vastly overestimating or underestimating. Too easy. Too easy. That's crazy. How many reps was that? It was like 14 or something. <laughs> Holy crap. Coach. You said you do mostly incline, right? No, no, that's just me, that's just me. I yeah. do like 60, 70% incline, but I, I go 50, 50 sometimes too. So typically after this, I'll hit a flat press of Let's some sort, but I don't know what flat press would be best. Not pumped yet. We're on our way. It's because we do so, not enough volume. Just get bigger and stronger, but you don't get pumped. Yeah, you usually do way, you do way I have to compete right? with this. No, I do lower. Really? I switched my style up, yeah. I used to, to, get, should be lower. to get a pump. They just to get the pump, but not when I'm actually training, like 10 reps max usually is what I do. Tall people problems. Yeah. I wouldn't know what that's like. <laughs> Wonder. What a burger I had last night. Almost 3,000 calories in one burger. 3,000 calories? Did you track it? I can barely no, get like 1,000 in a meal. I did. I had two double cheeseburgers, which is 1,000 calories each. I had uh, three tenders with the honey mustard. I had a you got large, tenders too? Yeah, I had, a, <laughs> I, had, I had a large fry, and then I had a large Coke, and then I had two spicy ketchups. Okay, you definitely got close you to 3,000. You like Whataburger better than In-N-Out? I think In-N-Out is the better burger joint, but Whataburger has more variety. Where if you wanted to pig out and go crazy, yeah, it's a better like cheap meal option. 100%. In and out's like a more convenient tasting for burger. Sure, for sure. I love the refined talk around yeah. Whataburger and In and Out. <laughs> I, I love that. I, I love fast food. <sighs> that natty strength. <laughs> that natty See, that, I have to make up for it. <laughs> I have to make up for the lack of size and strength. Because you haven't told the people yet that you're on gear. Must be it. This guy's, this guy's gonna expose me, mm -hmm. even though I'm natural. <laughs> Some, somehow, somehow he's gonna convince everybody like, that guys, I... Guys, I've spent plenty of time with TNF. He's lying. <laughs> I've been to the Echo Meets. He takes SARMs. It's like, Joel bent over in front of me and I pinned him. Joel was too scared to do his first Five day. days straight. <laughs> Do you do any sort of incline flies? Or do you? No, I'm just asking, do uh, you? I, I go back and forth. Honestly, whatever's open to my gym, I'll go back and forth between like incline flies and flat flies, depending on like. What do you do for incline? I'll just like dumbbells. Cape, cape dumbbells? I, I can do cables. I like cables too. It's up to you. Mine are always just taken at my gym, so it usually ends up being. I picked I picked this exercise, so you have to pick the I next picked the one. first one. Yeah. So now it's Dawson's turn. I don't trust him. He's all, <laughs> <laughs> the bicep curls. Weird, I don't look as heavy as you guys. The old man the old strength. Man strength yeah, for like sure. Old man strength, strength is real. Whenever people on my live are like, we want to see your physique like not pump fast, and I'm like, I barely get a pump in the gym. <laughs> like, I'm always it's, not it's the pumped. Same, it's the same. Oh, oh, my boy sweats. A little bit. <laughs> it's just a little bit. So, oh, this is weird. Uh-uh. Yeah, with cables. So like if I'm trying to do an incline, I usually use cables. If I'm just doing like a flat, then it's usually the pec deck. You spot that arm, I'll spot this <laughs> arm. Sorry. <laughs> pump cover coming off? I, I, I'm not pumped at all, man. It's not gonna be like this grand reveal. Oh. Okay. It's more so just okay. The excuses. I need it for the, I need it for the YouTube the video. The excuses man. are coming out. I need it for the YouTube video. 
See, I used to care, and then I realized that every year I got bigger, I essentially looked like myself before, pumped. Yeah. So I was like, oh, well, who cares? Like, they, I would have been so excited to be this size a year ago yeah. on a pump. It's like, why do I care now? I just feel like the bigger I get, the shittier I look. Yeah. Constantly, over. This guy's got some over. crazy body to smoke, over. yeah. You gonna go up or you gonna stay here? I'll do whatever you do. Hey, you think I'm wishy-washy? That's not wishy-washy. I'm, I'm decisive. I'm doing whatever you do. That's right, decisive. Well, I'm gonna go up. Do you want, you want me to keep these here, Dawson? Uh, no. No, 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 these. That's a fucking cannibal go for it. See? All right. Let me be objective about this for a second. Oh. Which one we on this one? Be a, it'd be a fight. After a set, we'll stand with set by side and be objective. Well, you're 6'2", right? Yeah. He's 6'1". No, not even. Six foot and a half. Six foot and a half? Yeah, so we'd be a little bigger. Yeah. Not much. It's close. Do you know how much lean muscle mass you have? I do not. He's weighing, he's weighing 240 right now. How much lean muscle mass? It fucked up. <laughs> this is usually the best way to be objective about it. You take a look, you say, what's your height? What's your weight? What's his height? What's his weight? It's like, he's six foot and a half. And he's 240. Yeah. You're six foot two. Yeah. You're yeah. you're six foot two, around 235. You're also leaner than him. So if we were to give him your same leanness, he would probably only go down to like maybe 230. Yeah, but you're over that. an inch taller than him, and each inch is gonna add at least at your height is gonna add at least like eight or nine pounds. So objectively, he'd be a little bit bigger. You can see the difference in like. He does have a men's physique shape. Yeah, very Versus much more. Me, I, don't have, I don't think I have the men's physique shape. His, his clavicle structure is wider. Yeah, yeah, dude, wider. it sucks. Wait, sucks? It sucks, dude. <laughs> Filling <laughs> out up. is Shut a up. nightmare. Dude, I've, everybody I've, wants wider clavicles. I've trained what are you talking for about? 12 years now, and I still have not fully been able to fill out my clavicles. And I train hard. Can I always have. mine is narrow or normal? It's... Probably a little bit narrow, but you have big enough delts to make up for it. Yeah, and then like, and when you stand like that, yeah, all you would need to do to round out that pose, go ahead again. If you got these to pop out just a little bit more, nobody would think twice about it. <laughs> just me sitting here admiring your chest. <laughs> a, little, a, little, a little sus there. <laughs> a lot of half reps. I'm just kidding. I was gonna say, I can't tell if you're joking or not because I could hold it here forever. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You, you can't make me laugh during his set. You got salty for a second. <laughs> I hate you. All right. Lock it. So you've never been top posing before? No. Yeah, cause like, Never. cause you're, cause you're posing side chest completely straight up. Bring this up. Yep. And then what you do? Bring this completely next to the other one, halfway up. All right. Make sure the hamstring is not flexed. You want to let the hamstring hang, and then just open up fully. Give this knee a little bit of a bend. There you go. Turn to the right. I'm just gonna go up here. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep creeping forward to the mirror. That's a sick pose. Yeah, that's a good pose. These guys are too big. These guys are too big. have what's like what I call a box chest, yeah. you'll look really good from the front. The inserts are low and it gives you like a more broad shield appearance. You don't have that, I don't have what, that. What, do I have to what you have is a bit of depth. Yeah. So when you have depth, you can make the side chest work really well. Okay. So is, it's like- Is that more width or is that more like depth from the side? It's yeah. depth from the side. So like, okay. if you see where you insert, like a lot of people <laughs> like, like insert down here yeah. and like down here, which gives them a, a longer, fuller chest. Yeah. But for you, what was 
your stage weight at your last show? Uh, 206, 207. Right in there. Really? Yeah. Where do you Where think you'd be now? Think you'd reach 215? Uh, realistically, for, from someone who actually knows what a 215 looks like, like at true conditioning, no. I think if I was like perfectly dialed in, like actually conditioned where I need to be, to 13, 212 maybe, and I need to be to like 217 minimum. Like 217 is where I need to be. In order to what? Compete. Yeah, but compete, compete at what level? Pro level. Like to be competitive. Okay. Like, I mean like first call-outs for me. If I'm 217 on stage with like the conditioning like, that I normally have. At which show though? Like at a, re at a regular pro show or at like a high level pro show? Honestly, it depends if I compete correctly. I've never, I've always come in condition, I've never spilled. I've never not once come in full. Not once, ever. Like when I won my pro card, I was flat as heck. Super flat. My pro show was even worse. I looked so shitty. Uh, over training, uh, under eating, overdoing, like doing like double the cardio. I just dove, like dug myself into the ground with that. So I came in looking horrible. I was, I was, I looked pretty bad for that show. I was, I was grateful to even get 11th out of 35. I was like, I don't think I should have got, I thought it got like 30. I remember you showing me pics from that though. And I get it, like everybody gets in their head. You didn't look horrible. I didn't look horrible, like, but I didn't look good either though. Yeah. You set a high bar for yourself. Yeah, I, I, I mean, I that was the first time I had never not gotten first call outs. And that was like excruciating. Right. Especially being the first show that I had actual people come to to support me. And I'm standing on the sideline for 15 minutes while they do first call outs. That was a bummer. I know some people swear by dips for the chest. Nope. No. Heck no. <laughs> like, I can literally see it. I. I I'm watching him do this and I, I can see what's happening. When, regardless whether I'm straight up or completely bent over, yes, there is some level of activation because like that's how the body works. Yep. But it's always majority, 60, 70% always triceps, yeah. like minimum, so. That was way more reps than I wanted to do. I was about to say, I was like, there's a oh, lot. I got halfway through and I was like, I might as well finish it out. How much did you get? Uh, like 18, 19, 20. <laughs> Damn it. No, like it's a lot. <laughs> it was not like, Eight. Oh my god. Your tibia is a little longer than mine. <laughs> or just bigger legs. <laughs> my quads are just so Don't thick. Don't laugh at me. quads are just so thick. Don't patronize me. He's getting there. That's after a cheat meal. After Whataburger and a, and a, and a non-diet Coke. Yeah. A large, this fucking big. I'm, oh. I'm mad at you for the non-diet coke. You told me. The like, non, <laughs> it's like non-diet like, coke. It's like, hey, the one, it's like the one thing that you could just like switch out, no problem. If you're going 3,000 calories a water burger, the diet coke doesn't matter anymore. You might as well See, throw a normal yeah. coke. And that's the mentality oh, you have to change for prep. I was at the beta land. All right, so we just got out of beta land. Like, All the betas, like, home of the alphas. <laughs> of these guys, <laughs> fucking losers. The biggest alphas in the gym. The biggest fish in the pond, as someone said. Yeah. It was uh, good. We hit a chest day. It was definitely interesting to see, you know, difference in physiques, different in strength. Um, but and you outlifted uh, absolutely everyone, huh? Look, I mean, I don't want to be the one to say it, but, but yeah. something like that. Anyways, uh, it was good. It was a good lift, especially with three people. It had a, it was a good dynamic. Um, yeah, it was fun. And then now, took some pictures, posed, got some content for you guys, and then now we're gonna go get some all-you-can-eat sushi, I believe, because. Nah, it's, we've been here for way too long. Here? Alright. We're eating sushi. I actually have goals. So, you know, I eat sashimi. They, they, eat, the, they eat the crap stuff. I eat all the shitty stuff that tastes good. Look yeah. how bad this guy is. No. <laughs> After three hours of talking about a natty mindset versus an enhanced mindset, we've nice come to say. the conclusion that enhanced mindsets mean golf. it's a better one of course it's of course the better one to have and but. that's why both of these guys are single <laughs> <laughs> didn't get us at that one. damn Hard punch to <laughs> <in> the gut <laughs> my new relationship is with tnf so that's yeah. not true yeah you will find your latino woman though one day for sure yeah 100 yeah, percent. fat booty juicy latina but all righty well that concludes it i think for this vlog i don't really have anything else to say we got sushi we came we conquered we prospered so i'll catch you guys in the next video in like eight months or something